everybody. This is Tara, the Funkaholic. How are you doing tonight? And Boss Man Bill. I asked how you were doing, not trying to make up your sad little story and place in the world. But I'm here. Well, <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't do anything yesterday like oh yeah my my um I hope you guys got my message I left one on one of the things and it should have come up I just was very very depressed and hurt um my tummy is giving me problems and that's probably from being depressed but I'm kind of pulling out of it Bill's in, <laughs> in the doghouse. What is wrong? I know. Okay, so I have a shout out. This really nice man named Ringo. We did a, a like a, a pop trade today in Eugene at a really cool um, pop. Uh, it's like a no, it's not a toy store. It's not a toy store. It's like a pop culture store. I mean, they have pops and minis and um, some hikaris and comic books and aisles and games. But it's all pop culture related. You can't go in there and buy a hula hoop. You okay. Anyway, um, yeah, this very nice man named Ringo just looks at Bill and recognizes him <laughs> and recognizes me, but he recognized Bill. Okay, so yes, I did. It's a thing. Just don't do that. Don't go there. I'm having issues with my hair. I'm having issues with everything right now. <laughs> But I just want to shout out to you, Ringo. You really made our day. That's the first time ever we've been um, recognized in public except by our friends, which, except by our family. <laughs> we don't really have a whole lot of friends because he's just not social. So, so, I got pops. I, okay, I'm doing his side of pops first, and I'll do the ones I put over here. And I'll, okay. I'm getting the Ant-Man ones. You know, I keep getting them and put some half sets, in, and then I get rid of them. I see. I sold some on eBay two times. I got rid of my Minecraft set. <clears throat> and I got rid of my um, uh, Sonic set. Is it Sonic? I got rid of? No, it's not Sonic. I don't know what it was. It, it's, it's on there. I think it's already closed, but it's sold. So, yeah. Excuse me if I'm just not pull, pulled together in here feels a little better. My stomach I still wake up with like a stress stomach ache. I don't know what it is, but I have to go to the doctor and see. Yeah, this wasn't a good idea. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got this from Target. It's from Ant-Man and the Wasp. Ant-Man and Wasp. And it is Janet Van Dyne unmasked, which makes me think she had a mask, which makes me think she may be the wasp. What's really weird is there's the ghost, which I have with, no, maybe not. I don't know. I thought I had the ghost with another set. Anyway, so that's that one, and it was in Target, as was Pikachu, 
but we got there too late to get one, but Pikachu did drop today in Target, and um, we didn't get one. <laughs> These are exciting. I Last time we went to this same, which was a while, it's been a few months back, we, I um, mean, I thought it was, it's a swap, but I didn't think you could sell anything. But then last time people just wanted to know how much money we wanted. So we ended up selling. And so we ended up selling this time too. But last time I made a whole lot of trades. I only did two trades this time, but I think they were really good ones. The first one was for Jessica Rabbit. And I traded my um, Deadpool t-shirt and um, pop uh, set, Funko pop set. I have never even seen Jessica Rabbit in person. And while Jessica Rabbit is not my favorite Disney character, because I, I think she is the one character that would make Walt Disney turn over in his cryogenic grave. <laughs> See what I did there. Um, I, I was excited to see her and so we traded even Steven and I really, really like her. It's like the oldest Disney pop I have. This one's exciting because if you know the story of poor me never getting the bloody Xenomorph from GameStop, I got it. What did I trade for this? Some kind of pop. <laughs> I don't remember. It was just like, <laughs> no, I sold that one. I sold Chicken Deadpool. And I told the lady I was going to scratch off the name and put Cannibal Deadpool because he was eating chicken and they hadn't even noticed that, she, that he was eating chicken, wearing a chicken costume. I'll put this down now. You have no more pops? Because I gave you just a few now. I know. Yes, we got some yesterday. You know, I wasn't going to buy this one because I think it's really silly because the only difference that I can think of is that he doesn't have that little thing on his head. Can't even tell unless you're looking for it. But, like an idiot, born... <laughs> I won't say that. I'll get in so much trouble with half of the country. But anyways, I wasn't going to get it. But I can't complete this set, which I'll never complete the set anyway. But I'll never complete it because... Um, if I don't have the spot, right? It makes sense to me. Okay, and these next two things I got from the Funko shop, the pop-up shop. By the way, those those um, uh, thingamabobbers, <laughs> those lockers, with the pops in them that you could buy. The Fun Go Fun Day. Yeah. Those are cool. Some guy had, um, well, several people had a, a locker. But um, I didn't get to see, I don't think I did. I didn't get to see a um, Buddy Funko as Pennywise. That's the pop I want. But I'll wait and see if they go up or go down or whatever. But what I got was Monster Cereals, and I got Yummy Mummy and Fruit Brew. And they're vinyls. But, you know, it, it's... I, I have always collected things with advertisements on them. I don't know what it is. It's some kind of weird disorder or something. Like, I collect pogs. Someday I'll show you my pog collection. If you don't know what that is, they're little things that imitate. I actually have some real ones, though, that are supposed... 
they went into the top of milk bottles and then you lift the tab and pull it out and they're little like caps. I don't know if it makes it airtight, but I just love them. And then I collect, um, I did have a collection of, uh, I can't find it now cause he lost it. And I had, <laughs> I had, I probably still have it. I have a Coke uh, calling card. Do you remember when it used to cost you a whole lot to call long distance so you would get a calling card. And I won one that had 10 hours of airtime on it. And it was only one of 10 in the whole wide world. Um, so I, I, I own that one somewhere. Also, I, it, you opened, uh, well, the, you had, okay, well, I won it. I see, I can't even explain it. Did I show you the pop? Yeah, it looks familiar now. Okay. And this is the last thing. This is the Captain Crunch <laughs> cereal. These are the cereal guys. There's Captain Crunch, Fruit Brute, uh, Crunch, Crunchberry Beast, and I think that one is Sand Dog or Somebody Dog. Sea Dog, Sand Dog. <laughs> I don't know which would be worse, having seafood in your cereal or s some sand and a dog. <laughs> I'm just a little giddy because I'm going to be normal probably by tomorrow. <laughs> Whatever normal for me is. Um, so, okay, don't forget. Ow. And hit that. Come here, I want everybody to see your eye. Look, look at, ow! Remember when I had mine? I was smart enough to get mine up at the top. He gets his right, right there. That's, that's God right there punishing people. God does karma. Huh? Karma. Yep, you got your karma back. Enjoy. Anyway, um, don't forget that the drawing is next Tuesday. Wednesday? The first. Next Wednesday is the drawing on, on the 1st of August. And mm, trying to get relaxed. And I just keep looking at how horrible. I have no makeup on. My hair could use, oh, I don't know, some water on it, maybe. Shut up. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyways, um, so yeah, if you are new here and you want to enter the drawing, make sure to, ooh, Make sure to um, subscribe to my channel, our channel. And hit notifications so you get notified when I knew it, do a new video. So you can all just rush to your computer and watch the video. <laughs> um, okay, and then you know, if you could <laughs> just overlook this situation right here and give, give my videos a thumbs up. Uh oh. Chocolate ice cream. I'm good. And um, then, yeah, give me a thumbs up. That helps so much. And also leave down in the comments that you want to win either a Pennywise, which is, is a um, Amazon exclusive holding Georgie Porgy's um, severed hand and wrist part because he bit it off. Or you can win the surprise drawing of the month, 
which is 11 a box lunch exclusive <laughs> box lunch exclusive which has uh, 11 with egos and she's got the dark hair it's from last season season two when she went to find the other girl that was in the program that had her her tattoo with her number on it all right well I guess I'm done disappointing everybody. <laughs>